Hey everyone, it's Yoslin, and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make these really cool ankle bracelets. These are really easy to make, so if you wanna see how to make them, then just keep on watching. So these are the ankle bracelets I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make today. They just look like this. They go in like a spiral pattern, and then I have this other one. This one's not as neat because this was my first attempt and this was my second attempt. So the more you do this, you do get better, but it's really easy to do. To make these ankle bracelets, you're going to need thread. I'm going to be using four different colors and these were 56 cents at Joann's Craft Store. We're also going to need buttons to have the ankle bracelets stay closed. I got these at Joann's for $3.99. These are pricier, so yeah but it does make the ankle bracelets stay on better so you don't have to use these these are just optional and you're also going to need scissors and tape i don't have an exact measurement for the string but you want to make sure that you have enough or even extra for the bracelet as you can tell this is really long the reason why i don't have measurements is because we all have different ankle sizes so once yeah. you cut your first string you want to match up all the strings to this one and cut them the same size Okay, so I've cut all my strings the same size, and as you can tell, this is really long. And the reason why this is so long is because you are going to be folding this in half, so it's not going to be as long as it was. So once you fold it in half, you're going to want to tie a knot at the top. And keep in mind, you want to keep this knot kind of small because if you have a big knot, it's not really going to hold the ankle bracelet when you attach it together. So this is the size I made the loop. I made it this size so that when I put my buttons, it'll fit perfectly. So now I'm going to be flipping my camera so you guys can see how to do the pattern. So you're gonna wanna put the thread on a surface and you're going to want to get some tape and you're gonna put one across like that. And then I also like to put one like this just for it to be extra secure. And then that's it for the tape and that's gonna hold it down while you are doing the pattern. So how to do this is you're going to want to get one of the strings from the group and you're going to want to make a four. Once you make a four, you're going to want to put your hand through here and then grab the string. And once you do that, you'll be able to just pull it up. So I'm going to do that again. I'm going to make a four, like so, and then I'm going to put my hand through here, then grab it from under. And then just slide. Now I'm going to be doing the rest in fast motion so that you guys can see how it turns out. Once you're done with that color, the way you switch the colors is you just get whatever color you want next. So I'm going to do this one. And then you just keep doing what you were doing before. Do the four. Pull it up. And then you just start your new color. And then you do that with all the colors until you're finally done. So I have finished making my ankle bracelet and I have measured it around my ankle to see if it fits and it does. So now that I'm done, the way I'm going to finish this off is I'm going to be tying a knot on it. Just a regular knot how much string I had left. I did have quite a bit left, but we are going to be adding on our button now. So as you can see, it has an opening. So I'm going to be fitting three of these in here because that way the button will be extra secure. Just pull that button through like so. And once you have done that, you are going to be tying a knot right here. If you want the button to be extra secure, you can do another knot. I'm going to be doing two knots, that way I know that it won't like slide off. And once you have tied your knot, you're going to be getting your scissors. You're going to cut this, and then you're going to cut off this extra thread as well. 
Now you are all done with your ankle bracelet. So here is the finished ankle bracelet. I really liked how this turned out and it's super easy to make. And I'm not going to be putting this on my ankle, but in the thumbnail, I will have this on my ankle so you guys can see how it looks. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!